Another reason today is memorable. Quite a sight outside tonight. If you've been out to check this out, we have a full moon that's also a super moon and a total eclipse of the moon. We kind of sped it up there just a little bit. It wasn't moving that fast, but a lot of people geeking out over this tonight. Yeah, Mike. we're all nerds tonight. It's kind of <laughs> cool to see with uh, the eclipse now at totality. That means that the Earth's shadow is completely covering the moon. It will stay that way for the next 15 minutes or so. Then as we go through 1127 tonight, you'll start to notice the Earth's shadow move off the face of the moon. The reddish hue that you see is because of the atmosphere and dust in the atmosphere here on Earth that is reflecting. Uh, refract, <laughs> refracting and reflecting the light. It is not what accounts for the blood moon name. Blood moon just means this is the fourth and final eclipse of a lunar tetrad. That's four straight total eclipses of the moon spaced at six month intervals. Again, has nothing to do with the color, but it does look big and bright unless you're in central Minnesota or southwestern Minnesota or northeastern Minnesota, where unfortunately, guys, we got skunked with some clouds. Those clouds will bring a few showers here to the